The driftwood is finally in the tank, guys. Hey guys, in today's video, I will be adding in driftwood into my Altum Angel fish tank. Um, but before that, if you're new here, please make sure to hit that red subscribe button below and also make sure to give this video a thumbs up. It will help me out a lot. So let's get right into this. So this is my Altum Angel fish tank. It is a 2x2x3 two by two by feet tall tank. And before I put the driftwood into the tank, I want to get the water level a bit lower around this area so that when I add the driftwood in the water won't spill out because it is a quite it is quite a large piece of driftwood that I'll be adding into this tank so I might as well do a quick water change and while the water level is low I will quickly add in the driftwood and then top the tank back up there is one bucket um, I'm gonna do another one I could put the wood in now but I do, I'll do another one so that they can get more water change <laughs> so as I'm filling my tank back up with RODI water as you can see right here I will go ahead and add the driftwood into the tank. So this is my driftwood that I just washed. So I've got my two nice driftwood here, very heavy. I'll just put that down right here. And then we'll put this into the tank. Hey guys, so right now it's pretty late and after that time lapse that I just did, um, I went ahead and moved the driftwood a little bit. Um, I did that, I took my time doing that because I didn't want to rush the whole thing because my autumns would get scared a little bit if I move the driftwood around quickly and that's why it's this late at night and I have to whisper so sorry about that. Let's go and take a look at the tank now and the, the driftwood that I just put in there. Thank you. 